Hello everybody, I'm Zenith Rule, and welcome back to the channel. Um, I just wanted to talk to you about a few things that are going on behind the scenes. Uh, first of all, we're going to be updating and rebranding a lot of the things for my various different shows. Uh, for a few different reasons. Uh, for a while I've wanted to really move to uh, more professional title cards, move, move to more professional setup. Um, Zenith will review as a brand was okay, but it just felt somewhat clunky to me. So for uh, the foreseeable future, I have updated all my title cards. I have done a lot of rebranding going forward um, for a few different things. Uh, there is another reason for this, however, and um, it's why I wanted to really uh, make this video today. And um, this is probably the hardest video I've ever had to make. And I've made uh, a couple hour and a half long videos about One Piece. Um, but I just wanted to talk to you about something very personal to me. And uh, this is something that I normally don't bring up in my videos because I tend to keep personal stuff out of my work. It's just, I, in general, I want to talk about the media. And um, in general, that's what I focus on. Um, but this is going to up, uh, this is going to affect the branding. It's not going to affect the content or the show, but it is going to affect the image of me going forward. Um, you guys know me as Zenith, but in real life, my name is David DiGregorio, and. Um, for a while now, a lot of things have been changing for me. Um, it's very hard to describe, uh, but I suppose I should just be blunt. Um, I discovered last year that um, I was trans. Uh, something that I've been thinking about for a long time. Uh, something that um, I didn't realize initially, but definitely makes a lot of sense going forward. Um, I really started thinking about this when uh, my, my friend Yezu Otaku came out and um, Zach basically uh, kind of lit a fire in my brain, started thinking about a lot of things and um, things that happened when I was younger and things that um, didn't make sense then but make a lot more sense now. Um, you see, when I was a kid, uh, I was not the very, <laughs> I was not the most manly, boyish person ever, and um, I got teased for that a lot, and I got um, picked on, and I, I, there were a lot of things that really did not click in my life because of that, um, but it didn't start to to feel like there was something weird going on until around high school where. There was a time where I had a friend, and we were hanging out, and I was about to say goodbye to him, and for some reason, um, in my mind, I was just like, I should kiss him, and um, that felt weird. Um, I started thinking about a lot of things with myself that day, and I, for the longest time, I thought I was gay, but um, when, when Zach came out, um, I started thinking a lot of things, and... Um, I started talking with a lot of people about what transgender even meant, um, what it means to feel like you're something you're not, or to uh, be caught up in a gender that is really not who you are. And um, about a year ago in July, um, I started exploring this, and I started de deciding, okay, wh whether or not this was who I was. Um, you know, I started trying on dresses and started doing more feminine things, things that um, made more sense to be more, were more comfortable to me. And, um, you know, things just kind of clicked from there. Like, I, um, I it, it just, it started to make sense. Um, life up to that point hadn't really made a lot of much, a lot much sense. Um, for a lot of reasons, I mean, 
there, there's quite a few things going on. Um, I, I suffer from depression myself, which is why sometimes there's video delays here and there, and uh, I do try to strive to get beyond that, and uh, depression is not an entirely easy issue in and of itself, um, but I also have uh, basically this chest disorder, which calls me, causes me chest pain like every so often, so like I can't do work. Um, I'll just, I have to stop what I'm doing for like an hour. So, um, in addition to everything else, I, you know, I sat down and I said to myself, uh, I'm a woman. And, um, this has been kind of a hard journey for me. I, I came out on Facebook and Twitter about a year ago, but I didn't really know how to put it on film for you guys because, like I said, I kind of want to keep my personal life out of my videos because you guys just want to see my content. But um, I recently started Hormones about six months ago, back in January, and I don't know if you guys have noticed, but in the past few videos, I, I have noticed myself that it's getting very hard to hide um, the changes that are happening to my body. And with the laser hair removal, and with the way my image is changing, and with things going forward, um, I know I'm going to get a lot of questions, and um, so I decided that this is the time to tell you guys that I am in fact trans. Um, if you guys want to ask me any questions, feel free to do so. I'm not going to disable the comments or likes or whatever. It is what it is. If you don't like this, that's fine. My videos are still there for you to view. They don't have any... Um, they're not involved in any of this personal stuff. But I did have to, uh, going forward, I knew that I wanted to rebrand with different title cards and, and to focus on this going forward because um, I don't want to hide who I am. Um, I am who I am. That's, that's not something that I can really change. And there's a lot of things that um, are, are me, you know? I, I I deal with them and I move forward and I try to put out a lot of really good content for you guys and if I succeed then you know I, I hope you you continue to like that but um, this is something I need to do so I made a bunch of new title card templates and stuff and so going forward you're going to see um, a more feminine looking Zenith and uh, in those title cards and uh, because that's who I am going forward. That's that's who I am. Um, I mean, I've been, like I said, I've been on hormones for about six months now, and things are rapidly changing to the point where possibly in a, in a few months' time, I probably won't be able to uh, hide the fact that I do indeed have breasts now and, and, and stuff like that. Um, but, uh, again, this is, this is all for... Um, rebranding the channel, just making sure that the channel is um, a representation of what I am, who I am. Um, again, if, if you don't like that, that's fine. I respect your opinion, you know, just as long as it doesn't harm anyone, you're free to do whatever, but um, my videos are still going to be free of, of any of this uh, Essentially, I don't want this to really bleed into my videos. I just want to make sure that you guys know that this is who I am. It's going to reflect in the branding image. Um, but that's about it. Uh, I'm sorry, I'm kind of, I'm usually not at a loss for words, but right now I'm kind of trying to, I'm struggling to find the right words to say things. Um, it's a, this is a hard video to make. Um, in any case, uh, yeah, um, I'm me, I'm Zenith, I, I, am a, I, I am a woman. I, uh, it's a strange thing to say, but I am, and um, I'm not going to change anything about myself that, you know, that you guys enjoy. Uh, obviously, I'm not changing my voice. It's, it's going to be the same, just my image. Um, and going forward, uh, I will continue to provide content just about each and every week for you guys. Um, 
I thank you for your support over the years. Thank you so much for everything. Um, just having you guys uh, as subscribers for the past seven years now has meant the world to me. And um, I am still the same person. I am still Zenith, and I have been the same person before. It's just I finally realized uh, who I am. So again, if you guys have any questions, feel free to ask. I don't. I don't mind answering questions um, about depression or about um, trans transitioning and being transgender and stuff like that. But um, anyway, uh, next time you see me, I will have more Danganronpa up and more videos on the horizon. There's there's a lot more planned, and um, we will be a lot more ener energetic then. Um, anyway, guys, I'm Zenith Rule. Uh, I've been stammering on for a little bit now, but anyway, thank you guys so much. Um, I just wanted to create this video to let you guys know what was happening because things are going to be changing in the future. In any case, once again, I am Zenith Rule, and I will see you guys next time.